Hey, what's up everyone? So welcome back to another video and like I promised on my previous uh, builds uh, of Windows 10 mobile uh, Today I'm gonna show you how to get Windows uh, Windows Facebook Messenger the new Facebook Messenger for Windows 10 the new uh, Universal application uh, as you can see here on the right. It's for the tablet so for ta for desktops and Here it's for the the version for mobile which I'm gonna show you f just fast how it's uh, not just let, let it open and I will show you how to get it first and then we get straight into the application so here is the application and you just open it's like a it's not like a it is a wrap from iOS so to get it go uh, open the link that I will leave you on the description and this link will get you to the Microsoft to the store as you can see here messenger beta so this application you can see it on the store only through this link and you will see it here uh, hopefully okay now let's get here let's get press the button get the application get the app it goes straight to the store it will open oh, hope you see it will open and yeah the new store it kind of opens a bit slow and here it's the you can see here it's everything detailed blah 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 but you will not be able to get it it depends where you live uh, for example my settings are set set up for uh, english for us um, and here you'll get like a option that the, the, the application is not available it's not available for your device uh, and to get to fix that go in your settings then go in time and language and then region and here you see here country region my my set to United States go here and change to change to uh, I I choose when I installed I choose uh, where is it I choose Germany and then I restart in my phone and it, then it works proper nice but you can choose also uh, you can choose French you can choose French it also works or Italy you can choose Italy French or Germany and it works I tested with Germany and it worked no problem and then after you set your language to Germany or French or whatever restart your phone you must restart your phone and then press again on the link and it will come here you see here uh, this product is already installed so I can launch but for you it will be like installed application let's launch it uh, and it opens and this is the new application uh, you can see here on the right it's unfocused but it's like it's the same and it's like how it's a wrap from iOS because it's it oh it's ported as you can see here when you swipe from the right you have more mute or delete the conversation let's see what's in more so in more we have block mark as spam archive mark as unread <laughs> or cancel let's cancel then on this tab here I, I thought it, you can scroll like this but on the people you have all the people on your Facebook here is the recent and then on the last tab it's the settings as you can see it's very similar to iOS and of, of course it will be similar to iOS because how I said it's a ported uh, messenger from iOS then here you can edit notifications how you want to see the notifications do not disturb show, oh, show previews yeah I want to show previews Okay, so you need to slide that notifications and messages sound vibrate um, then you have photo media report a problem problem <laughs> and then when you go in the um, conversation um, you can have you have here if, for example if I press on gifs here are the gifs as you see it crashes of course how it's a it's a better it crashes um, but it might be also my version of the phone because when I installed this uh, redstone build I didn't do a hard reset so it might be also that problem but yeah it crashes and also install the application on your internal uh, memory of the device not on SD card because on, on SD card I saw that it crashes more times and it loads a little slower let's go again if you go on GIFs now you can't type uh, you can't type now for typing you press again on this AA and it brings up the typing and hello hello my friend I'm pretty sure he will answer my friend and to send it you you need to press on the send button if you press on this one it will not send you need to press on the send button then you can take here a, a picture 
let's open, yeah. You can take a picture, as you can see, it's it's like, it's the same as on iOS. Uh, you hold for video, tap for photo. When you hold for video, it will crash, that's still a bug, it doesn't work properly. Then here you can send the picture that you want, then here, here we have the all the emojis. Uh, and there, on this version, it doesn't have the, the call button and the, vo the, the voice call and the video call, it has only record, so you can send a, mes uh, a voice message, but you can't call that person, which on iOS there is such option, but here it's not st still not that option, but hopefully it will be in the next versions, <laughs> I don't know. And hello my friend, let's send, it sended very easily, and here also check mark that it sended. Let's bring, oh, mouse, get out of here, let's bring this. Hopefully it's focused, uh, and you can, as you can see, it's almost the same. If I press, it's synchronized. It's okay. Install. <laughs> it's synchronized pretty easily. But as you can see, it crashes on the phone. Uh, on the desktop, you already can download it officially because it's available. It's available officially, but on the phone, uh, how it's it's still a beta. It crashes as you can see. Uh, but I use it f f with I use it many times as you can see it, it's uh, synchronized very easily uh, Let's I'm gonna type him uh, How are you? How are you? Let's see if it synchronizes it synchronizes here also. It's everything almost the same people here settings settings are also the same uh, and yeah uh, Here for example, I sent him a video. I recorded a video and sent him uh, through mobile application and it worked per perfectly. Here is the video. You can play on the video and it will load the video on no a problem. Uh, you press on it goes in full screen, press again it goes minimizes and it works pretty good. The only problem for now is that it crashes but of course how it's in a beta version it's supposed to crash and it's supposed to not work some, uh, some options but yeah this is the new version. Uh, let me know if you could install it and if you like it and as always thank you guys for watching and i see you on the next one